walk like an Egyptian. We well, have Egyptians, you have mummies. So we're down at the Haunted Farm down by Walnut, Illinois. And uh, we've always come down here during the daylight. We got a spooky character here. And we have a dude in a trailer. Looks like a guy nose ring. Aren't these attractive? So this nose ring makes this guy look as attractive as what I find other people with nose rings. I'm sorry. I'm just poking fun with people with nose rings. So these guys are taking this guy for a walk. Oh guy here. Guy with horns. I once saw a sheep with horns like that. And we got um some characters over here. So we brought Adrian down here. We brought her down here when she was two years old. We bring her down here every year. So I wonder if she had breast implants. They're messed up now. Apparently they're trying to shoot an apple off her head and they missed. And then we have uh nails. Uh, got a catapult of some sort. Let's walk over here and see what we got. Oh, we got a stretcher. So, this is a uh, this is how Jody handles uh, when she's X-raying people and the and the patients are unruly. She tapes them down with duct tape, puts tape over their mouth so they can't cuss on her. I'm just joking, obviously. That would be, I'm sure that'd be against some type of uh, um, policies at the hospital. She actually did that. This person's not ready to lose their head. That looks painful. So we have some funny looking people. We've got some bright lights here. Go over and see what we got here. Problem is, like, you wouldn't know if there was a. I got a person hanging. So there's so much stuff here, I don't think I'll be able to cover it all. So we got a wheel of fortune, death, um, walk of nails, all kinds of stuff. So you spin that where. And then, uh. Looks like a bad day for you, ma'am. Wheel of Torture. Your hosts, Hannah and Matt. So, not responsible for accidents, dismemberments, or uh, death. Did I look at those people? I don't know if I did or not. Come walking over here. So each year they get something new down here. So I've never seen this trailer before. So person with a with a uh, I think that's a sling blade. Some people call it a Kaiser bag blade. I call it a sling blade. We've got skeletons pulling the trailer. We have a graveyard, so Mildred Parish. So your typical uh, tombstones. Every year they add a few more. Gets bigger and bigger. So we have a, a witch who uh, ran into a pole. This is actually the telephone pole going down the road. So they take advantage of everything. Hey, it looks like uh, they're going on vacation. Hey, it's ZZ Top. Let's see what else they got. 
They got a hearse over here. Hi, skinny boat. Hi, skinny boat. <laughs> Yeah. Tombstone hauling ash. So, if you want to uh, shout out to these people, uh, just, just Dirt and Vant, Haunt Farm, Lisa and Skip, we're in between Walnut, Illinois, and Ohio, Illinois, on Route 92. So, give them a shout out. She's uh scary. So photo op if you dare. So you lay in there, get your picture taken. So I got no way to take my picture, so I'm gonna pass. So So once again, uh go to Facebook and like their page. Give them a little shout out. That's their driver. So this thing actually runs. They have this in parades. I've seen it. I've got some people here. I don't know what are these people doing? Now they're looking for treasures, metal detectors. So we got over here. Ah, look here. We got Planet Fitness. We got a guy doing bench pressing. Um, got treadmill, zombie U, got a referee, exercise bike, elliptical, all kinds of cool stuff. Somebody could be dressed up in one of these things or just stand there, I wouldn't know the difference. So we have, uh, the beauty shop. Got a, on the computer screen here. Going trip and fall. So you're getting your hair done here. Got a couple mannequin heads. Some different stuff. Let's go over here now. Here we have our concert. So we've been to concerts that pretty much <laughs> resemble these guys. What do you think this resembles? The Rolling Stones or that guy looks a bit like Mick Mars a little bit. So uh, these guys have been drinking all night playing poker. We have um the classroom. What are you finding, Adrian? I found, I found the one. The snack pack. Oh, Don't get that on yourself. <laughs> it's lunch, kids. Adrian, I don't think you're supposed to do Don't that. Don't do that. Dump that back in Dump there. Dump it back in here. It's, it's screwed down. You can't move it now. So we have a. We have eyeball soup. What do we got here? Rock. Is this cigarette butts? I think so. We do have uh, uh, fruit options here. What was in there? So stuff's cooking. Lunchroom lady. Paper. Ghoul Patrol. These must be the guards. And let's go this way. Trying to stay away from the people. So they're open every night till about 10 o'clock. And they shut the lights off. When the lights go off, it means they're done. They don't charge any money for coming here and checking us out, but they take donations. So we usually leave them like 20 bucks every year. And they they uh, keep adding to it. Um, either people donating stuff, or they just um, so there's a blender. It looks like there's a brain in that blender. This one here has uh, feet, 
with uh, cutting out the spigot of blood and stuff. Uh, Thanksgiving dinner looks like a duck and um, some bones. Looks like gut soup. Somebody hanging out there. Goosebumps. A good scare. A bucket of uh, guts and stuff. The baby. I've actually seen babies that are uh, um, just as ugly as this one, to be honest with you. Buzzard food. So I might have to like speed this up a little bit. Gourmet pizzeria. Gourmet pizzeria. That looks like uh, our bearded dragon, Lizzie. We have cockroaches. Uh, ragu. Pasta. Um, so I've actually have seen people's houses that resemble this with the cockroaches. The finger cockroaches. Uh, gourmet pizza. Oh, they're actually are eating some of the gourmet pizza over here. Avengers. So, is this must be a tattoo parlor. Get your tattoo. Have a slot machine here. And go over here. Music's playing. Ice cream, you scream. Grasshopper. Blood ripple. Blue tongue cockroach crunch. So you get your uh, ice cream here. So when I was a kid, we actually had a washer machine like that. Looks like a maybe a daycare. Person lounging. More kids, kids playing. To be honest, I I take these kids any day of the week over real kids. Kid in a Barbie car. Melvin the magician. Got a crib. We got a game of checkers going on here with uh, playing with rocks. He's a uh, bad shape. Got a little neck injury here. That person, uh, person's been here for a while. Maybe they didn't have a propane tank and they had oxygen instead. Oh, they got x-rays hanging up in the window there. Um, I need to get Jody over here for her uh, diagnosis. Noah Pulse. Noah Pulse Memorial Hospital. Aquarium. <laughs> Over here, over here, it's a green hail. Electrical box. Alright, let's go this way. We need to check out this area. Let's go over and see what's who's hanging around over here. Hanging from the tree. Somebody rolls in their head. Well, this is kind of pretty gory. It's holding the head of the 
thing. There's like bugs and stuff over there. So when Adrian was two, we stopped by here. And the Channel 6 News from Quad Cities was here. And they interviewed us, me and Adrian. And uh, I tried to find that video online, but the link to it is no longer good. So a couple bikers here. Do we have a wedding? Looks like we got some uh, brides and stuff. Guy performing the wedding. Those eyeballs look real. Oh, it's a dance. I get it. He's the DJ. So, oh, they're all dancing at the wedding. I see. Got a couple uh, tiny people. We don't call them midgets. We call them tiny people. Oh, I mean, that was alive. Oh. <laughs> all right. I almost tripped on a cord. <laughs> Chain and rope restraints are us. Let's see. Got some type of smoking thing. There's a little dog locked up. Got in here. Got a some type of black bird. Got a monkey. Something a live trap. All kinds of little captured critters. We have a carpentry shop, maybe. He's uh, making a coffin. Looks like they're uh, carpenters over here. Got part of a coffin here. We have saws and all kinds of woodworking equipment. Oh, we got some uh, skiers here. You know, they shouldn't have their life preservers on, but they don't. I guess they're a combination between fishing and uh, um, maybe he's bait. I don't know. So, I've got some. We got some campers. Got a fire going. And they're roasting. Uh, they got an arm. They're roasting. They're drinking Dr. Pepper, Mountain Dew. So they give a Mountain Dew a bad name. People. These are the best dressed. Uh, these are the best dressed um, zombies here. We have a banshee apparel open clothing you'll scream for. <laughs> so, so every year this gets bigger. It's probably 50% larger. Maybe not quite twice as large as what it was when we first came, but maybe 50% larger. Come here, Sigma. Stop running. All right, a bunch of kids there. They're just having fun. So we have a little. Looks like we've got a moonshine thing, maybe. Some different goodies in here. So they uh, incorporate all kinds of cool things into their haunted farm here. Let's go over and see what's uh, over here in the corner. I think this might be the Roadkill Cafe. <laughs> Highway Caviar. It's 
So, got a bucket full of roadkill. There's something they're scooping off the highway. Ah, uh, roadkill, fresh, buck 99 pound, rotten, 499 pound. And then we have people eating over here. They got a, a bloody uh, little something. I tell you, some of these eyeballs of people look pretty real. And it looks like they're cooking up stuff right here. Canine cuisine. So they got a puppy here they're cooking on the grill. I should have used the spatula. Roadkill Cafe. And they have a menu. So there's the menu. Slab of lab. <laughs> Pit bowl pot pie. Cocker cutlets. Poodles and noodles. Collie hit by a trolley, German shepherd pie, round of hound, rack of raccoon, a smear of deer, awesome possum, cheap sheep, and then the last one is uh, the special, guess that mess, bag and gag. Um, where's that at? Bag and gag. Hard day to take out anything dead but some bread. So, <laughs> pretty. Pretty cool stuff. It looks like they're looking for me. And then we have a person mowing. That's why Jody doesn't get to mow the yard. Oh, it's a science lab. And then we have a yard spreader. I'm making a video, people. Don't be in my video. Go, do you look in the corner at the road? Kill Cafe. Go read the menu on that building over there. Where? Over in the corner. Voodoo Services. Um, don't know if you read that. Voodoo Services. I can't read that very well. My balls are. And then we have Pet Cemetery. Rover got run over. Freddy or Frog, he croaked. Lucky, the three-legged dog. Rex the rabbit, not so lucky. Mr. Bubbles, Pollyanna, squawked her last. Meowch Tiger, Buster Beloved Pet. Felix Nine Lives Bless A Pet Cemetery So That is kind of um, I went through this kind of fast Even though I've been at this for 25 minutes or so Walking around There's Still stuff we didn't see But it's an annual um, event we like to do come down and check this out and see what creative things they've come up with each year each year they they have the uh, a lot of the same things but they come up with creative new things every year so if you haven't been here for a couple of years you're bound to see something new and a little different so I don't think I was over here I was kind of over here but uh, this person is using this Hoyer lift to help this person out of the chair. <laughs> long, long time ago, I worked as a CNA. So I know exactly how these things work. And that is what happens. They put these straps on people, then it cuts into their armpits, and they scream in bloody pain because they're hurting. This guy's got an arm coming out of his head. So, we weren't. I didn't stop and look at this stuff. Um, we have some. Uh, so this is the hospital over here. And this is the, the waiting room, apparently. So this is your typical um, emergency room at your typical hospital. You know, people come in, they wait for eight hours. And then they either die or just leave. That's how it usually works. 
So, um, a little portable potty thing. Oh, so this person is, uh, must have a habit of trying to bite people. So they got like one of those, uh, thingies on. This person's just totally ignoring, got their headphones on. And, guys okay, over there. So I thought that corn stalk was on it was part of a display. So these people um, apparently have a bad habit of a biting. So they got these things on. They know how to babysit. And we were over here. So what I'm gonna do is uh, wrap up my tour and uh, gather up the, the zombies and head back home, I guess. So, fingernails and eyeballs. So, so somewhere they have a donation box, probably up here by the back door. So if you come visit, make sure make sure you toss in some money. Like I said, we usually put twenty bucks in there for them. It's well worth it. Where else can you get this much entertainment? Um, yeah, so, once again, in between Walnut, Illinois, and Ohio, Illinois, and Route 92, you can find them on Facebook.